Howdy, friends, and welcome to The Average J. <laughs> Today is Wednesday, January 11th, and we are in front of Artie's groomer. That is why Artie is with us. Well, he's laying down now. There he is. What a good boy. So, we haven't had him groomed in a couple of months because whew, I'm really unsteady on this. I, I don't have it on a uh, tripod or anything. But um, In December, he was supposed to be groomed, and we were late getting back from Florida. That's the problem with scheduling something like the day you're supposed to get back. And if you run into a delay, then it doesn't work out too good. But... Uh, so we had to cancel that one last minute. And this is the next appointment that he was scheduled for. We schedule a couple months out because this place gets really packed. But uh, hopefully Artie's gonna look all nice and clean in a few hours. We'll come back up to pick him up. The one thing I will say is, you know, we really like this groomer. We, we like the young lady, uh, Rosalie, who does him. She does. She's the only one that's ever worked on him, right? Correct. Oh, no. <clears throat> Somebody else worked on one time. We hated it. So th that didn't work out. But she moved from the groomer she worked at to this place. And, you know, it's like a 25-minute ride. 20, 25 minutes. And it's street parking. There's no lot. So, you know, you always have that, like, little nervousness of, am I going to get a parking spot? You know? So, but, you know, we, we left early enough today. We're actually, it's... 10 of 8, his appointment's at 8, they open at 8, so uh, we're actually just sitting in the car waiting for them to open, but uh, once they open, we'll show you the inside. So one thing they do is, outside of the store, they put um, doggy treats, and a lot of people walk their dog in the street, so they come and get treats. And I, we've seen like five dogs get treats out of there so far this morning, sitting here for 10 minutes. But this is it, Scissors and Suds. I mean, it's in a cute little town. It's in Collingswood. All right, there goes Artie. Going in. <laughs> See, there's dogs all walk down the street. Oh, that's so cute. How you doing this morning? Good, how are you? Good. And this is where we get Artie groomed. It's such a cute place. <laughs> okay, it is 11.30, so three and a half hours. Luckily, we got the 15-minute uh, parking spot back again. It was open. You can park here for 15 minutes because at this point... We're after 9 a.m., so they enforce it. So we're going to go in and pick Artie up. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Have a good day. <laughs> there he is. Hi. Hey, Artie. And everyone, this is Rosalie. She has done Artie since he was a puppy. She's the only one, one time, one time somebody else did him and we hated it. So you're the only one, but she is the best. And again, this is Scissors and Suds in Collingswood, New Jersey. Look how great he looks. Whoever took the picture of him looked amazing. He did so well. He did. We were surprised that he actually sat still. Well, we have a treat behind the camera, of course. There you go. See the magic. All right, so now Artie gets the ride home. He's uh, all lined up looking out the window. Artie. Yeah. Aww. You going to say hi to everybody? No. You going to say hi? All right, now we're going to drive him home and give him some breakfast. We, we saved a little special breakfast for him. <laughs> when we get home, obviously Artie's going to have to do his business. He's been, you know, cooped up for 
a couple of uh, hours. So, but if you see all the little green flags, all the little green flags, we take little marker flags and, uh, that's how we mark where he is going to the bathroom. So oh, that's nice, <laughs> but I'm just saying, um, because in the fall and the winter leaves or snow, you won't be able to see it's like landmines. So we put the little flags out. So one, two, three, four, five, uh, it's about time to pick it up. Sometimes he just likes being out here sniffing the air. Mm -hmm. He does. It's a dog thing. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes he'll fool us though. He'll make it like he has to come out to go to the bathroom, do business, and he'll just come out here and do just okay. what he's doing right now. <laughs> just stand and take it all in. For breakfast this morning, Michelle and I made omelets and pork rolls. So we made sure that we saved some of the omelet and pork roll for uh, Artie. Is this for you? Is this for you? Oh, let's see what happens when we put this in here. Takes seconds. Seconds, I say. He is not missing out on any. <laughs> is that all gone already? All gone? No, it's not. He smells there's still more up there. All right, I'm gonna give that to him. Okay, we are gonna walk up the street to uh, our pastor's house. Her, uh, uh, my pastor's dog, Ellie, just had 10 puppies. Uh, I want to say a little over a week ago and this is dangerous because walking already up this street come on Artie this way <laughs> walking already up the street was how I broke my phone last time he turned back to me jumped up knocked the phone out of my hand and that was how my screen got broke so <laughs> but we're gonna walk him up to our pastor's house and see the puppies Golden Retrievers all around. They are Golden Retrievers. I forgot to mention that. Going to get some Golden Retriever cuteness overload. She has puppies Go ahead. that are available. She what? She has puppies that are available. Oh, I think she does still have. have some. I'll ask if they want the contact info. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. You don't want to stay out there in the cold. No. So we have Artie with Ellie checking each other out. Yes. We've met before. Yes, they have. But it's... Like He's on my domain. Yes. Yeah. But it's just a shame because, you know, already being fixed, we would love for him to be, uh, would have loved for him to be, uh, to be the stud. The stud. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You know, so. Yeah, absolutely. Ellie, you got a friend. Here. Golden Retriever Overload. Oh, you got a friend. That's right. So here are the babies. There are 10 of them. I believe it's six. Girls and four boys, or was it? Oh, I got the backwards. Six boys. Six boys and four girls. So, and Ellie, Ellie, baby girl, you're so precious. You're a proud mommy. But they are beautiful babies. Ellie, you're doing so good, girl. You're doing so good. That's gonna do it for RD Day Part Two. We've had other RD Days, but <laughs> we never record them really. No. So, what'd you think? How he looked? He looks amazing. Does. And he smells delicious. So good. I'm we washing all the blankets and stuff now. Yeah, so that when it comes to bed, it won't smell like old, old Artie. It will smell like new, clean Artie. Yeah. But we had a great day with Artie today, taking him, getting him groomed, letting him go see his buddy Ellie and the puppies. Yep. And um, if anybody's interested in the puppies, message me. You can uh, email me. I'll leave the um, email down below in the uh, links, averagej at comcast.net. Um, if anybody's interested, they do still have some available. And also, Ellie has her own uh, Facebook page. So go to Ellie Miller, E-L-L-I-E-M-I-L-L-E-R, two separate words. If you want to see other pictures of the puppies or if you're interested. But, um, They're so cute. They are so cute. But today was definitely a golden retriever kind of day, but that was the whole point of it. You know, we kind of wanted to give people, you know, a lot of people make comments in our videos about Artie. You know, he's a pain in the backside sometimes. He's so sweet. He's so smart. <laughs> he's oh so God. smart. He's too smart for his own good, yeah. you know, but, um, which 
just wanted to kind of give you a little uh, time with Marty because he is a sweet boy. Thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe. We'll see you later. Bye.